Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss how to fix Helldivers 2 game guard error code 1013. Are you a fan of Helldivers 2 but frustrated by encountering the issue? 1013. So you are not alone. Many users have encountered this frustrating issue. To fix that issue, you can follow these some simple on-screen instructions. Solution 1 is close background application. So to close the background application, you can simply press Ctrl Shift and Escape on your keyboard. After that, your task manager will be open. Here you will see in a process bar a unwanted and unnecessary background applications. So you can simply close these applications, which one you want to close. And, and then click the application. After that, click on the end task in the right top corner. After that, this application was closed in the background. So a, some, sometimes a simple close the background app can resolve your issue if your issue is not resolved then we move to our solution 2 our solution 2 is launch hell divers 2 with admin right reinstalling game guard and running the game as an administrator is another suggestion solution this may help to address the error and allow the game to turn without encountering the game guard so to do this you can simply navigate to the hell divers 2 tools bar and folder and use gg uninstall.exe to uninstall game guard from the game installation directory after uninstalling game guard and then run double g setup.exe with administrator right to install game guard in the game installation directory after that start the game with administrator right to ensure that it is running smoothly without encountering the game guard error code 1013 solution 3 disable real time protection so, sometimes a simple disabling the real-time protection can resolve the issue. So, to do, you can simply type setting on your search bar. And here, move to the privacy and security. And here, click on window security. After that, the window security of your PC open. Here, you can simply click virus and threat protection. After that, a new window will be open. Here, click the manage settings on a virus and threat protection setting after that click on manage settings you will be uh, the page will be open here a real time protection is shown so you can simply disable these settings and click on yes after that restart your pc and then relaunch the game so sometimes a simple disabling the antivirus can resolve your issue because a some files the game wants they are system antivirus disable it solution 4 whitelist held diver 2 try whitelisting the game in your antivirus or firewall settings this can prevent the antivirus for firewall from interfering with the game anti-cheat system to whitelist held diver 2 and resolve potential issues such as the game guard error code you can follow these steps first is window security Open your antivirus and window security application and look for whitelisting and inspecting allow list. After that, add Helldivers 2 to the whitelist and navigate to the add and add a exception section and browse to the directory where Helldivers 2 is installed and select the main executable or the game folder. After that, save the changes and exit the antivirus or window security application. Step 3. Restart Helldiver 2. After whitelisting the game, restart Helldiver 2 and check if the game guard error code is resolved. If not, you can move to our solution 5. It's verify Helldiver 2 game files. Verify the integrity of game files through the stream library can check whether if the issue persists. To do, you can simply verify game files and reinstall Helldiver 2 by following these steps. Firstly, right click on Helldiver 2 in your stream library and select properties. After that, go to the local file tab and click verify integrity of game files. This will scan for corrupt files. Launch the game after the scan is complete to check if the issue is persist. Solution 6. Contact Helldiver 2 support. If none of the above solution resolve, you can simply go to the Helldiver 2 customer support team. They may have specific troubleshooting steps to resolve your issue. You can simply raise a query by using call and message and after that chat with and call with the executive. They can help you to do. 
they can simply suggest you some simple steps and you can follow the steps that they given and after that your issue will be resolved so these are the some simple troubleshooting steps i hope you like this video please don't forget to follow subscribe and share we will catch you up in the next video goodbye